Chloe, <clears throat> long is the winding road that led us here today, but there's no other road I'd have taken. You, the woman that restored my faith and love, you probably do not know this, but five years ago, with my future turned upside down, I embarked on a spiritual analysis of what I need for my life partner, that you fulfill and support me in all the ways that I thought I needed, in ways I never knew were possible. You are the only person I want to build a life and family with. I vow to treat you as my equal and love you above all others. And I vow to do everything in my power to remind you each day that you are one of a kind. With a beauty, intelligence, and compassion rivaled by no others and loved by me above all else. Bryce, today we step into a new chapter of our story and I couldn't be more excited. Together, we have built a house and have worked together to make it our home. But as we learned together over the last few years, home means more than the four walls around us. Bryce Alexander Loken, finding you was like finding my home. Loving you has been my greatest adventure. Today I've become your wife. I love you now and forever. Chloe on their daily round to the prairie house rising from the muddy ground. There they saw a little tree uprooted and alone. They found a shovel to dig a hole and stood the tree straight again and whole. Then warm spring rains and bright sunlight brought the tree to life one April night. The buds burst forth and with strength and hope showing how to survive and cope. We are hoping that Chloe and Bryce will build a, a great future for themselves. A toast to the couple, the tux, and the dress. fell in love with. Chloe has captured your heart with her beauty from the outside, but also from the beauty on her inside. Chloe, 
you're marrying my first son, my first boy. The one who stole my heart the minute he was born. My son has taken you as his wife. I am so happy that I officially get to call you my daughter-in-law. Love is the most beautiful thing there is to share. When you have it, embrace it, share it, and never hold back. So raise a glass and cheers to the two of them for a life, a lifetime together. I've been lucky enough to be there for a lot of their first moments. I was there for Chloe's first time playing darts. Um, and if you've never played darts, maybe you don't know that you don't do a full overhand throw. <laughs> and when you hand it to the next guy just waiting for darts, you don't kind of give him a kung fu chop. But you never know. But you know, what kind of relationship have I seen? You guys have laid such a beautiful foundation. We're here to support you the whole way, through thick and thin. And we're so excited to see where it goes. To the Lokens. It feels like only yesterday we were awkward 15-year-old girls daydreaming about being each other's maid of honor someday if we were lucky enough to ever find anyone who would marry us. We were very dramatic. Chloe's the type of friend you can never get rid of, nor will you ever want to. Chloe is someone who truly cares. Seeing her with you, Bryce, makes me so incredibly happy because I can see that she found that person we daydreamed about many years ago. I wish you both a lifetime of love, laughter, and lots of patience. Anyways, I love you guys, and cheers to you, but I forgot my glasses.